waste waste goes up into that tank there, bins all of it, and all the waste gets um, pushed down to the bottom. So that water, rich in ammonia, it goes into this tank, and that turns all the nitrates into nitrates out across in this tube into the poly tunnel. Big koi carp, and then, and then we've got the crayfish in there. Oh wow. It comes down into this NFT system, which stands for nutrient film technique. There's a little film of water running along the bottom of the pipe, it's all soilless growing. So the plants take all the nitrates out. These are all our seedlings. When the roots are long enough that they're coming through to get into the film of water in here, they'll move out of there and plug into the system. Water that comes back out of here comes through the flood and drain, drains out into the sub-tank block. You lift it up. So this water is pumped back in and it's purified for the fish. So all the fish waste and the toxic stuff for them is actually nutrients for the plants. If we go back in and see what's going on in there now. What's special about this as opposed to normal aquaculture? It's completely self-sufficient. Yes. Soilless growing, so you don't need a lot of room in the ground. You need so much soil, fertilized soil, to plant it all in. And all the water just goes around and around and around, you don't have to keep topping the water up and drain it out. The other thing is the byproduct of your of your system is the plants. 